Hello, Jupes I'll be reviewing an application known as AntNotes. So essentially what AntNotes does is it provides several notes that you can apply on your desktop and you can fully format these and customize them. So you basically have these little panel like notes that you can see here and then they automatically align to other notes that you have on your desktop. So you have several options. For example, you can pin this note and then if you open up another window, it'll always appear over that window. Then you can unpin it and it'll be just fine. You can also move this anywhere on your desktop however you'd like and it'll always be visible for you to see. Then you have a translucent effect so you can see behind behind this. And you can also adjust the color of the background to however you want. Or you can go to other and then you can select different colors or spectrum images. Your scales are standardized colors. Inside here you also have several other options including you can change the font or you can make a certain text bold for example. So here if I really want to remember to do my reading journal I can bold it or unbold it. I can remove text. I can do other text and I can change the font of everything inside here. So for example let's say I want my homework to be bolded. You can head over to font. Let's make this common sense. I changed the font to comic sense 14. I can change it all to marker felt for example. So this is how it works. Now let's select all the text and change it to Comic Sans 14. Now you can also change the text color, for example, you can change, change it like this, change it to black, however you want. Now sometimes the controls that I found within this application is a little bit confusing and it's sometimes annoying because you can try to control Z something but it doesn't actually work the way you want to. So I want black text but now I have to go all the way back to background and change the background. So sometimes it's just these little things that sometimes are annoying when formatting, but certainly all the functionality makes up for that loss. So here I have three different panels, they're all over here, and if I want to access something more specific, I can head over to my ant notes, and I can make a new note or hide note. You can even copy these notes, and then inside here you have preferences. So for example, running the application after logging in, use this small menu over here, and you can make certain shortcuts to ease the operation of actually starting this. So here you can also save it and then you can quickly remove it. So this is something that I do and I keep it on my desktop and I highly recommend this application. You can find this application on the Mac App Store. So thanks for watching this video.